My name is uh, Lyndon Rive. I'm the CEO of SolarCity. I'm very excited about the products we're going to be announcing today. It finally happened. The long wait is over. For only 22 cents a watt, Tesla 4.0 Solar Cell will blow your mind. The solar race is in full swing to expeditiously increase the renewable energy sector. Recently, Elon Musk unveiled an astonishing never-seen-before power cell that is significantly less expensive and produces a vast supply of energy. So, are you curious to know more about these new solar cells? Let's begin. Solar energy is a clean, sustainable, and powerful alternative to fossil fuels, and it has become the third largest renewable energy source after hydropower and wind. Harvesting as much of the sun's energy as possible is a rapidly growing industry as the energy from the sun's rays is more than 10,000 times that of the world's entire energy demand. Bell Laboratories introduced the world's first commercial silicone solar panels in 1954, and since then, numerous technologies have emerged that utilize various sorts of psi-based solar cells to convert up to 20% of sunshine into power. Generation from solar photovoltaics, the process of converting sunlight into electricity, has increased to 720 terawatt hours from 585 terawatt hours in 2018 and is projected to increase to 1,940 terawatt hours by 2025, as per IEA's market estimate. At its present peak, solar energy's global capacity is 592 gigawatts and provides 2.2% of the world's electricity. What are the current and upcoming innovative materials? Semiconducting materials like P and N-type silicone are the backbone of a solar cell, which also includes a multi-layer PN junction that is wired to an electrical system. When the panels are exposed to sunlight, electrons are emitted from the silicone. With the help of an applied electric field, the emitted electrons go through the PN junction and into the external circuit, generating a current, or electricity. Research and development on novel solar energy materials is at its peak to achieve maximum solar-to-electricity efficiency at low cost in response to a rapidly expanding market and the creation of new applications. Crystalline silicone, thin films, and the next-generation perovskite solar cells are three forms of semiconducting materials that are currently the focus of extensive research. PSCs Crystalline silicone Although the efficiency of solar panels made from crystalline silicone is far below the theoretical limit of 30%, crystalline silicone still accounts for more than 90% of the worldwide PV market. The use of solar cells fabricated from new, low-cost, high-efficiency materials is on the rise. High-efficiency crystalline PVs, such as 3-5 multi-junction materials with target efficiency of greater than 30%, and hybrid tandem 3-5 silicone solar cells are being developed at the National Renewable Energy Laboratory, or NREL. Under intense sunlight, their six-junction 3-5 solar cells achieved an efficiency of 47.1%. Furthermore, silicone-based bifacial technology is 11% more efficient in collecting solar energy from both sides of the panel. Thin Films Second-generation thin-film solar cells are among the most promising PV technologies because of their slim profile, 350 times smaller light-absorbing layers compared to typical silicone panels. Low mass, adaptability, and simplicity of installation. Their typical construction utilizes four different materials, cadmium telluride, amorphous silicone, copper indium gallium selenide, and gallium arsenide. While cadmium toxicity is a worry with CDTE solar cells, SIG solar cells with efficiencies as high as 21% are proving to be the more attractive high efficiency and cost-effective alternative for both residential and commercial installations. With their super light and extreme SIGs technology, Ascent Solar has established itself as a leading manufacturer of high-performance SIGs modules for applications in the aerospace, government, and public sectors. Perovskite solar cells. Due to their low cost, smaller design, low temperature processing, and excellent light absorption properties, hybrid metal halide perovskite solar cells have gained a significant deal of attention among the next generation solar cells. Good performance under low and diffuse light. PSCs can take on a variety of shapes and sizes depending on the application, and they can be thin, light, and translucent. 
An impressive roll-to-roll -roll printed PSC has achieved 12.2% efficiency, the highest among printed PSCs, and perovskite thin layers may be manufactured, allowing for scalable high-throughput manufacturing. Notably, Oxford PV has demonstrated record efficiency of up to 28% in mixed perovskite and silicone PV materials under laboratory settings. A recent low-cost polymer glass stack encapsulation technique has made it possible for PSCs to sustain typical working conditions, despite the fact that stability and durability have remained a serious concern. PSCs have not yet reached commercialization, but they offer the potential to significantly advance the solar energy industry due to their many cost and efficiency-related benefits. What are the breakthrough integrative solar cells technologies? In addition to breakthrough components, novel strategies for extracting the maximum possible amount of sunlight are also making inroads. Insulite, a startup based in Switzerland, uses embedded lenses as optical boosters in the panel's protective glass to concentrate light beams by a factor of 200, increasing efficiency by 30%. Prototypes of thermoradiative PV devices, sometimes known as reverse solar panels, have recently been developed. These panels radiate heat into optically connected deep space, which is then used to cool the panels at night, thereby generating electricity. Not only are new materials on the rise, but so are integrative uses that go beyond the typical rooftop installation. Solar distillation, for instance, can collect solar energy while using the panel's waste heat to clean water through a membrane distillation connection. Solar paints, such as solar paint hydrogen, which produces energy through photovoltaic water splitting, solar paint quantum dots, or photovoltaic paint, and perovskite-based paints could be another game-changing technology of the future. In addition, transparent solar windows are cutting-edge implementations, with ubiquitous energy's transparent materials achieving a sun-to-electricity conversion efficiency of 10%. In this video, researchers from Michigan State University, an early adopter of this technology, give a demonstration the solar energy industry is anticipated to grow rapidly over the next five years due to the rapid development of low-cost, high-performance semiconducting materials, space-saving thin films, and simply installable technologies. Although this renewable energy source has been pushed back by the epidemic, a 15-35% to drop in installation costs by 2024 is encouraging. Because of silicone's drawbacks, the hunt for better materials for solar cells has continued. Ferroelectric cells, usually produced from barium titanate, are promising because asymmetric crystals exhibit spontaneous electric polarization. They're more robust and easier to produce than silicone because they don't need a PN junction. When a substance is said to be ferroelectric, it signifies that its positive and negative charges are separated in space. The charge separation creates an asymmetrical structure that can convert light into electricity. However, scientists have only been able to use barium titanate cells to produce a weak electrical charge. This, however, is about to change. However, recent studies conducted at Martin Luther University Hall Wittenberg, or MLU, have demonstrated that solar energy yield can be greatly enhanced by latticing layers of three distinct materials together. The key here is the alternating use of ferroelectric and paraelectric materials. The latter doesn't have charged particles that can be separated, but it can become ferroelectric under the right circumstances. To do this, they sandwiched it between strontium titanate and calcium titanate. 500 layers contributed to the material's final thickness of 200 nanometers. Their initial expectations were shattered when laser light was shown on the novel hybrid cell, revealing a current up to a thousand times stronger than expected. It seems that the excitation of the electrons by the light photons causes the lattice layers to interact, leading to a considerably higher permittivity. Tesla launches new 420-watt solar panel. Tesla has installed more than 430,000 solar systems across the United States, making it one of the largest solar installers in the country. Installations are completed by our in-house crews, and service and maintenance are handled by local specialists, all at prices that are guaranteed to be the lowest in the industry, thanks to their extensive expertise and size in the accompanying price match guarantee. Tesla has made the ordering, designing, and installing of solar panels extremely easy and quick. When working with a conventional solar provider, the cost of the hardware is usually only half of the grand total, with the other half going towards things like design, permits, and installation. Tesla has introduced a new solar panel with a power output of 420 watts. 
making it one of the most powerful household solar panels available. A new solar module for Tesla's solar rooftop business is being surreptitiously introduced, while Elon Musk faces trial in Delaware related to Tesla's acquisition of Solar City. Although Tesla's solar roof tiles get all the press, the company's solar panels are where the bulk of its solar revenue comes from. Tesla's solar panel operations have been undergoing a significant overhaul over the past several years, and the company's efforts have now begun to bear fruit, with the business returning to growth during the past few quarters. Last year at this time, Tesla introduced a new solar panel and significantly reduced the cost of solar retrofits. By lowering prices and promising to match competitors' offers, Tesla Solar became more competitive, leading to a quarterly increase in installations to 92 MW. The Tesla T420S photovoltaic module is the company's newest solar panel. A new version of the manufacturer's online solar panel configurator has not been released as of yet. However, the company has stuck with using exclusively Hanwha Solar's 340-watt solar panels. But Tesla Solar installers have confirmed that the company has begun supplying a new, more powerful 420-watt panel. This panel is far more potent than anything Tesla has previously offered and is among the most potent residential solar panels now available. The solar energy industry is anticipated to grow rapidly over the next five years due to the rapid development of low-cost, high-performance semiconducting materials, space-saving thin films, and simply installable technologies. Although this renewable energy source has been pushed back by the epidemic, a 15 to 35 percent drop in installation costs by 2024 is encouraging. That pretty much wraps this video up, guys. Thanks for watching. So, what are your thoughts about Elon Musk's innovative solar cell idea? Share with us in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to this channel with a bell notification if you enjoy watching our content. We upload some awesome stuff here which you will most certainly enjoy. Hit a like on this video and leave a comment below. See you guys in the next one.